These are my two favorite tips to make your songs come to life. The first tip is filling in the empty gaps with reverb. So here I drew in the reverb when the synth stopped playing. Here's what it sounds like without. And here's what it sounds like with. The next way is adding reverses into the next note. These all sound pointless on their own. But if you bounce out the next note that's playing with reverb and then reverse that, you get this kind of effect. Here's what the drop sounds like without any of these effects. And here's what it sounds like with. 